Hey guys, it's me, Penny Ada Jasmine, coming to you with my opinion. So, okay, I was on these YouTube streets, you know, not minding my business. And so there's a YouTuber, he is big on conspiracy theories. Um, not that into conspiracy theories, but I, I okay, so I kind of sort of am into conspiracy theories. But my thing is, okay, so his name, his channel name is High Roots TV. That's the whole thing, High Roots TV, which generally I sometimes disagree. But, you know, like, I don't like to, like, not watch somebody's channel just because I don't agree with one or two things they say. I'm over here cleaning the wall. One or two things they say, you know, like, I'm into hearing everybody off for their opinion. That's why my channel's called Opinionated because I feel like nowadays you can't give your opinion about nothing without like, you know, getting your head chopped off. So, it's like, but today I was watching his stuff, right? So, you know how the guy that did, um, the, the the little Nas X guy, he. So I shouldn't be smoking, I just do smoke. So I'm trying to put it in a really damn chili. So that's sidebar. this point across without having my boss stare at me through the cameras like why is she on her phone so I thought I was gonna say I so he was talking about how he was talking about how little Nas X came out of a closet and Basically, he's saying it's all propaganda, and you know, the thing that I didn't like is that he said that it's like the music labels and all this shit that they, I mean, all this stuff that they're doing it to entice. Basically, he didn't use those exact words, so don't quote me on anything. But he was basically saying it's to entice the kids, you know, and I really disagree with that because you know what I. I admire Little Nas X for actually coming out very early in, you know, his career. Like, because this could be a little career killer, like, honestly. You know, because some people are very close-minded, you know. And in the hip-hop world, too, it's like, what? But that's, to me, that was back in the days. Like, nowadays, we have to grow and accept everybody for who they are. Remember to me, Lil Nas X is young. He's a youngin. He's like, what, 18, 19? You know, y'all drop down in the comments what age of y'all know. But, you know, he is in all his rights. Damn it, I gotta do this over. You know, okay, so he is in all his rights to be able to be um, clear with his fans and like let the world know who he is and what he's about. Like first he was criticized because of the whole hip hop country collab, you know, and that, okay. But to be criticized because he's gay and then to say he's coming out to entice children, like I'm not gay, but I got family that are. And I remember my little stepsister, literally this is not like a true story. My, I'm walking with my little sister, my little stepsister. And she literally, 11 years old, I'll never forget it. She looked at us all of a sudden and was like, guys, I'm a lesbian. And we were like, what? You know, and that, this was in the 90s, like early 90s. So we're like, what are you talking about? Like, you're 11 years old. You, she's like, no, when I look at boys, I look at boys and I like him, but I look at girls and I look at them the same as I look at boys. So basically she was explaining that she was bisexual, but she was so young she didn't know how to explain it. 
So I say all of that to say this. If you're a lesbian or you're gay, you are born. That's just who you are. That's your sexuality. That doesn't... That's not even who you are. It's just your sexuality, your sexual preference. You know, who you want to choose as your mate, your love, you know. So, who cares if he's gay or not? Like, I don't feel like that should be even a topic, you know? It, he, he would, like, I just, I don't know. It's the way that he was saying it. It was just sounding like he was trying to say, you know, that little Nas was pushed out by the industry to make our children gay let me tell you something if your child is gay they're gay they're not gonna be like oh they watch the show oh i'm gay yeah maybe that could happen maybe a kid could get confused a little bit but in their soul they know who they are like and to call gay evil see that correct me if i'm wrong guys go check that channel high roots tv and correct me if I'm wrong, if I heard wrong, that he said, you know, all of this is evil. Being gay is not evil. Like, I don't give a shit. I'm not gay, but I'm, my, I have family, my best friends. Like, no, you're not going to freaking say that gay is evil because it's not. And I believe that God takes everybody the way they take them, period. Anyways, subscribe to my channel. Love you guys.